are here with freshman tight end Josh Simon. Josh, tell me a little bit about where you find yourself working in the rotation among the tight ends right now. I mean, it all depends on what personnel the coaches got in for us and what we plan on running, like scheme. So it really don't really matter that much to me because I know somewhere I'm going to fit in. Now, in terms of schemes you talked about, is there something maybe it kind of more uh, adheres to your skill set maybe, another, a certain type of play or set that works towards you maybe better? I mean, I, I guess you could say that I'm about 20 pounds lighter than the rest of the tight ends in the room, so yeah. So with a deep tradition here at Western of being tight end, you, how do you look to make your mark upon that tradition here? Uh, staying the course, you know, trusting the process, trusting the coaches, believing in what they're telling me. And the school has already made its, you know, kind of reputation of being tight end you, so I just stay the course. So some veteran leadership ahead of you, Kyle Fortenberry, Steve Wachowski, how do those guys impact you as a player? Uh, they, they get me right in the, in the study room, in the film room. They make sure I know what I'm doing, where to go to, like on the combos, the fans, and picking up backers and things like that. So you had a good performance against Central Arkansas, I believe three catches, 53 yards, a touchdown. How do you look to improve upon that going in against FIU? Well, I just like to keep a clear head. I don't like to think about it too much. Play it how it come and whatever happens, thank the man above. So when you're kind of breaking down FIU's defense, turning their linebackers and safety, somebody that'll be covering you on your routes, how do those guys match up against the offense? Uh, we're going to have to see, man. We're going to have to see. Uh, I see myself winning. You know, that's what it's about, winning the one-on-one -on -one matchup. So when I get them, I'm going to try to make the best of the opportunity. So finally, what have the coaches really drove home this week in terms of the offense as a unit? What do you guys look to improve upon the most going into this week's game? Uh, we got to finish. You know, uh, Central Arkansas, we came out fast, but we kind of let up going towards the end in the last five minutes in the game. We kind of slacked off a little bit, didn't make plays. They made plays. So we just got to improve on the last five minutes in the game. Thank you.